Hi everyone. So today I'll be teaching you how can you make some overlays using Trapcode form. So yeah, let's get started. So first of all, I'm gonna add a solid. So after that, add form. Or it's a plugin. So if you don't have it, search on YouTube or you can just join our Discord server. You'll find it there. So after you like uh, added form, go to base form and change this to this one sphere lid and change this to XYZ individual and put the size X to 300 and size Y to 300 as well. Particle in Z, I mean size Z, put this to one and uh, put these to 100 each particle in X and particle in Y and put the sphere layer to 2 or you can just put it to 3 after that you can close this out go to fractal field put the displays to around 125 and you will see uh, something like this now you can close this out too go to base form again and we're going to keyframe the size x and size y uh, get to somewhere over here and put a keyframe on both of these and hit you to see all the keyframes and get to where you like want to end the explosion and change I mean just increase this like so uh, as you can see you kind of get this too and change the Y I mean just increase the y to until just increase the y until it fills the uh, entire composition and highlight these keyframes press f9 to ease them go to graph data and make sure it's on speed graph not the value graph and you can graph it like so and if you and if i show you it will look something like this and now let's add some color to it add tint and change this uh, white color to any color you want i'll just put it to blue because i just like blue a lot and after that add deep glow again deep glow is a plugin it's one of the best glows so if you don't have it just get them too after you add deep glow, it will look something like this. Uh, if I put it to full, you can see. I'll just pre-render it and I'll show you how it looks. You can see the particles are not covering the entire comp. You just have to increase the uh, these values, size X and size Y, and it will like fix it. So that's pretty much it, guys. I hope this tutorial helps. And let me know what tutorial you guys want to see next. I'll see you all in the next one.